Hey all, Board Game Rants here. We will find everything solo, tabletop, gaming, and more. So this is uh, Game of Australia. Just going to play for funsies here. I'll put a link up. I did do a solo tutorial. This will not be that. This is just going to be some Cthulhu ass kicking action. Here we go. All right, so we'll be playing on Insane Level. Again, this is all just for funsies. This is not to show you how to play the game. Uh, I just love playing this game, and I'm going to play this game. So I'm seeing a path here. So, oh, but first, on Insane Level, it just means you 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 add a starting tile to this 14. This looks like a fairly easy board. I mean, I only got three out there. You know, the old ones, the level three, you know, famous last words, but, um, and then, uh, restarting, starting resources are just like if you're playing multiplayer and that's kind of all there. You don't get any starting victory points either. So it's just, uh, uh, just straight up insanity. So I see a nice little path here. I'm just going to through right through the center of the outback, I think is the plan. So let's get to it. This is the uh, the little setup portion of the game where we go ahead and I think I'm going to pick up Harry Bones here. He's going to give us an extra resource. So that seems like a pretty good idea. Slide these over and to spend a time up there. <clears throat> Moving on, let's go ahead and start building some track. I think uh, we've got to get over that green. So we're going to do that. That's going to cost us three time. Oops, the resource isn't the right thing. One, two, three. And let's start chiggity chug chugging into the outback over the hills. Got. Yeah? All right. Now then, let's do some mining. Um, and let's just do it twice, shall we? One, two, two time and we get our gold plus one because good old harry <clears throat> and then um we get phosphate gives us three points and a gold but we don't get you mind we don't get any extra resource for the phosphates that's too bad all right <clears throat> let's keep going now i think uh, we're just going to keep chugging we're going to go here. We're going to spend the two time. Boop, boop. I'm going to spend the resources here. <clears throat> and let's pop over this way. And that way, I'm thinking. Okay. Um, ooh, okay. I can see Bombardier here. So let's, in preparation of that, let's uh, spend a little time building up our military and um we'll get the ugh, the artillery right out of the way we got five gold here boom grab up the expensive artillery right there then <clears throat> let's see here i've got three five six seven eight nine yep i'm okay on time i've spent it all um let's go ahead and take this import we're gonna bring in some more coal and iron so we can continue our track lane endeavors. Not going to do any, any farms yet. <clears throat> They'll just get mowed over. So let's just go ahead and gather up the crew. Back to headquarters, everybody. Okay. <clears throat> and um, we'll get right back at it. Before I forget, though, yeah, we definitely... Wait, wait, wait. Yeah. Ooh, gosh, take two, two and two. That is nice to kind of just still a little ways away. Well, first let's go mining. So let's go like there. Bop. We're going to take these three, but we get an extra one again because good old Harry. And then what, what the heck? Let's just keep, let's do the mining again. Might as well just. Keep a steady course. That's another three points. And a gold. Now, let's go ahead and make sure that we get Bombardier Milligan. And before he gets assassinated, slide that over. And 
Uh, let's see here. Did I spend the time for that? 9, 10, level 13. Yep, I think so. Um, so, let's go ahead and continue building in the outback here a little bit. Spend the time. One, two. L resources. Grab our track. <coughs> Excuse me. And let's go up and up. Just creep our way up. <coughs> Son of a gun. Excuse me. And. Hmm. Well, let's just go ahead and build up some more military. That'll be one time. I plan on grabbing two infantry. That'll be two gold. And then let's go ahead and, well, let's see. We might have to do some trading here. Spend the time. Let's go ahead and, um, well, let's trade this in for a gold. And then let's take an iron. And then let's spend, yeah, let's go ahead and bust on over to the other side. Spend that, which is gonna be three time. One, two, three. We'll spend the resources to build the track. And we're gonna just gonna Go right across this green here into that there fertile land. And then mm, we're going to go ahead and get everybody back. Cost us one time. Almost to the old ones already. Happens fast. Got everybody back. Destroying my board. Okay, now let's get... Uh, let's get some more resources. We'll grab this gold up first. That will be one time. Oh, it's almost happening. Oh, we get an extra resource because we got good old Henry. And then let's go ahead and um, start prepping by getting another personality here. It's going to be the old one's turn coming up, but not before we grab... Colonel Quarry. Bam. Okay, so Harry, I'm going to set you off to the side just for a little bit. No hard feelings, pal, but you're these guys. I need these guys. Old ones. Coming up. Here we go. Oh. All right. No more games. Well, in fact, a lot more games. Let's take a little break and get back at it. And by get back at it, uh, I meant that I forgot to set up good old event deck here. So, it is all set up now. Here we go. The uh, old ones are taking their first turn. Looks like they're going to go ahead and reveal an old one. We'll go ahead and slide their time tracker up. There they go. And let's see what number... What's behind door number one? Oh my gosh, we're getting off to a, a great start. Not even messing around. Okay. We're gonna flip over two cards for that movement. Nope, and nope. But he gets to go again. Flipping over, nope, and nope. Okay, all right. Pops up, but stays put. That's fine. Um, you know what? I have a feeling I'm just gonna. That's just. <laughs> it's gonna come. I'm gonna let it walk right into my port. You know. I'm going to first, hmm, I think I'm going to spend a time and lay a trap here. Spending a time, got to spend a gold because I'm taking the same action again. And we're going to get Ivan Karpov. If your port is attacked, inflict two damage at the start of combat on each attacker. Tee hee. Okay. So, bring it, Shogoth. Who's that? That, that. All right. Now let's keep going. We'll get another time point here to work with. Uh, well, let's go ahead and let's just keep um, building up El Militario. Let me go back here, spend our time. What do we want? Let's just, uh, airships. Let's get an airship. 
Gotta have a good old airship from afar. They're a little harder to hit. Two, three, four. And airship. Okay. Now we're talking. Okay. And very good. Let's see. Old one draws another card. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, reveal old one in the lowest numbered hex. And I get to take a personality card. Ooh, I like that. Well, first of all, let me take a card. Mm -mm, hang on. That's nice. This one's nice to be able to just get out of a jam. Hmm. You know, I've got Harry Bones. I don't think I need Donald McDonald. Um, so let's just go ahead and I like Corporal Jones. I like the, the, I like being able to push my luck and retreat when I've pushed a little too far. So we'll go ahead and set him over there. And now let's go ahead and reveal this old one right here. And it's a little baby kangaroo. Okay. So now we got to see if Shogoth moves. Nope. Wow. Okay, there you go. Now, I'm going to move towards six and then clockwise towards me. So it's going to go right there. Ah, I blocked my tracks. Well, hopefully now it keeps going because I'd be, I'm not going to be able to do anything really. Um, fortunately, it does get another movement. Boop. Two cards. Come on. Bring it. Oh, come on, Shogoth. Don't puss out on me. Oh, mother, you little son of a... Oh. Way to park it on my gall darn tracks. Jerk. Son of a gun. All right. Well, I'm going to play that way. Fine. Um, <laughs> well, then, that kind of changes stuff up. Let's go ahead and do a little importing, exporting. We'll spend our time here. And we'll go ahead and uh, we'll trade this in for a gold. And then we will import some iron so we can keep building track when jerk face gets off of it <clears throat> okay that was one action can't mine for any more goods thanks to you i'm not going to build a, a thing let's just go ahead and get our guys back yep spend a time get our guys back bring them all back to headquarters Make a plan of action. Cost us one time. Oh, let's go right into the old ones. They get to draw a card. Ooh, assassination. Oh, poor Ronald McDon or Donald McDonald. Toast Mundos. Set you over there. Slide you guys here. Okay. Very nice. Ooh, long range out back. Very nice. Okay, let's see if Shogoth mans up or monsters up and comes after me. And he does. So, comes right in. Don't need to flip over another card because that was the only guy moving. <clears throat> so, just for stepping on my territory. Did you see that I tried to grab three infantry there? Cheater. Okay. So, move up there. We get to bring it. And so, um, again, Harry Bones, this one we'll keep here. We do have artillery present. Ba-boom. We get to inflict one damage on an old one during combat. Skr splat. And if your port is attacked, inflict two damage at the start of combat on each attacker. A skadoosh. So, essentially, that's four damage. You, my fine friend, are dead. <clears throat> I don't know that I need to draw a card. I, it just doesn't matter in this case. So I'm not going to. So that was it. That was a little anticlimactic, but quite fun all the same. So that's what he gets for blocking my track. Um, so this is going to move again, but there's nobody to move. So I don't have to draw any cards. It's back to my turn, but now I can get back to work. We're going to spend the one here. Two, well, I already spent the time. What was I going to do with that? Um, ooh. Well, let's just go here and let's just keep working our... Um, so if one of my units is eliminated, I can return to the barracks. 
That's going to give me even more leeway. Sure. Might as well. Before he gets assassinated. Oh, that is good too. Oh, these are good. All the cards are good. Okay, now let's go ahead and let's keep um, spreading out. That's going to be two time though. So one, two. We're going to spend that and that. Let's grab our, you know, we're getting a lot of track out there. Maybe we should go for the Miss Bradshaw there, but we're going to go one and two. Yes. Okay. But now the old ones get a little string of actions here. Let's see what they do. Reveal the old one, the lowest numbered hex, but I get to retrieve an action cube. Take you. And let's see here, one, three, four, five, six. Ah, Temple of Doom. Okay. Well, but nothing, temples don't move. So it goes there, and it's going to get to go again and draw another card. Reveal the old one, the lowest numbered hex again. Shibbity boop. Shove it about. Number two. Okay. Giant ass mosquito. Hmm. All right. Let's see if it moves. Mosquitoes tend to move pretty quick. And it does. Move direction of four. So now if we tack that, we'd have to take on both of them. We're just going to sit back and wait for the mosquito, which again has four health, which again we're going to kill in one swoop. As soon as it hits my port. So we're just going to wait for it. And hopefully it doesn't block my gall darn track while we're waiting. Um, well, knowing that that's there, we better go ahead and start mining. We're going to spend two actions, just bam, bam. Hippity hop over that. We're going to get our gold. Plus one for Harry. And we're going to skip that for now. We're going to go with this. Plus one for Harry. Plus one Harry. Now, this gets to go again. Um, first it's going to move. See if Mosquito keeps coming. Mosquito does. You going to turn three. So it's going to go here. And it's blocking my track now. And again, nope. But they get another turn and get to draw a card. Reveal the old and lowest hex. So number one. And it's a little Joey. And let's see if the mosquito keeps coming. Keep coming, mosquito. One. Damn it. It's not going to do it. Two. Nope. It's going to park it in front. But that's all right. I got some mining out of the way. <clears throat> But it's called darn old ones. Um, okay, so let's go ahead then and take it. Uh, take a little time to do some importing and trading. Put that there. We'll go ahead and trade in both of these for two of these. Wait, doesn't make any sense. I have to do that. <laughs> I'm just gonna grab. Yeah, yeah, I'm just going to grab two, uh, two of those things, short changing myself here. So that was one action, and then, yeah, let's go ahead and build up our military, shall we? Let's just keep, <clears throat> what would we want? Now let's get to, let's go ahead and get, and it's on my track, and things just keep getting on my track, so I've had it, and I'm going to bring in an armored train, show them guys. These should all be slid down, but what else? Let's, uh, <clears throat> let's let it bring it on. It goes there. That's just a movement thing. And it moves here. And for all the reasons I explained before, boom, boom, chickity, boom, boom, it's dead. Okay. Teach you to fly into my port. Blocking my rails. Let's go ahead and uh, keep going. Gets to draw another card. Okay, that's this. Another mosquito! All right, Migu. One, two. It moves in the direction of five. <clears throat> there it is. Dang it, it's going to head from my track again. That's all right. Before, okay, I get to go. I want to take out this temple. I have a nasty habit of drawing the 
event cards that spawn the number three guys on those things. I'm going to just take it out. I've got everything to do it. I sure do. Oh, wait a second. Oh, let's get Professor Dude. So that'll be one because he can save us some time here in the stretch. This guy. Now we only have to spend, or we spend one less time point. Oh, who won Old Temple? Well, pfft. nah, that's all right. That's worth three points. I'm going to take it out. Um, and we'll go ahead and, and we'll, we'll, we'll use, well, we can't bring the armored train. And then we'd normally have to spend one, too, but we only have to spend one now because we got the Professor. And I have artillery going into combat. Oh, this is my first time. Boom. Going into combat. <clears throat> and there's um, Bombardier. Colonel inflicts the damage. Port's not attacked. Let's put that over there. So I can save someone and I can back out if I have to. But I've done two damage. Tough little temple. All right. Let's um, <clears throat> gear up our sanity tokens. Let's get to work here. Tempo. Hmm. Apparently, we're just going to sit and stare at it for a second. <sighs> Size it up. Ha ha. All right. Infantry. Moves in. But gets slightly scared. Lose a little sanity. Next one. Infantry. Infantry is um, toughened up a little. They're like, they're just going to keep on plowing in there. We got through the first fright, whatever that was. Now the balloon drops a bomb. Five out of six damage. But, <clears throat> that was pretty scary. Last one. Hopefully. Damn it. Nope. Does a little damage. All right. <clears throat> infantry hits head on something. And infantry does the last damage. This cube, we could just put it on artillery and nothing would happen. So, we are done with you, Mr. Temple. Dead Temple. Excellent. Let's refresh everybody here. And... Let's keep going. Boop. Uh, movement. Oh, there's no. Oh, wait, yeah, yeah. We got the mosquito out there. Here we go. That is a nope and a nope. Okay. Moving that. Gets to keep going. Reveal the old one, lowest hex, and draw six cards. Okay, I'm going to put this here to help remind me to draw the six cards. It's a number one guy. Okay. <laughs> It's a rather weak little zombie. Okay, six cards coming up for the zombie. One, two, three. It's a lazy zombie. Four. Wow. Five. Okay, finally moves. And it's going to move in the direction of five. That was the fifth card. Six. Okay, those are the six cards for the zombie. Now we do the two. Four. Regular. Nope. And nope. Okay, so they're just chilling out there in the outback. I don't know that we're going to come after them. I think, uh, I think I'm going to take some time here and bust some more track out. So we'll spend... Wait, what? What are we going to spend? Oh, if I do that, yeah. Uh, time's an important resource now, so we're going to spend the gold to be able to take that action again. <clears throat> it's going to cost us two time. We're going to spend... That and that. Now grab our rails. And let's just keep on working out here. There we go. <clears throat> there, now we have access to uh, these threes that we're going to want to expose here very soon. But it is Old One's turn. Okay, let's see if the mosquito or zombie moves. No. And Mosquito does four. Just going to head down. That was its two. Get to draw another card. Assassination. Okay. We can take it. 
discard those guys. I will slide you. Jeez oh, Louise, my board. There you go. There you go. Ooh, armored car. Armored car. Now, yeah, well, whatever. Um, and then we draw two for mosquito and zombies. The zombie moves. Zombie's really taking its time. And oh, it's got some pep in its step now. Okay, so it's gonna go <clears throat> clockwise towards me and eventually start moving that direction. Okay. All right, back to me. I still haven't blocked my track yet, so maybe, <clears throat> maybe, just maybe, I should, oh, shoot. You know what? Let's just get everybody back. Spend the time to gather round. And then, <clears throat> maybe we should do something rash. Hmm. Maybe we should just start exposing those threes. Hmm, no, or, no, let's, uh, yeah, 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 yep, okay, we're attacking, and, um, I can't use my train, but I can use everybody else, as long as I don't go after that three that's too far away, I can go after either one of those threes, so let's just go ahead, and, um, is that wise, though? Hopefully it's not a real bad guy. It's gonna cost me one time, because of my professor. And let's just go with this guy first. No, let's go with this guy so it's a little further away. Ugh. Okay. Big bag of Shogoth. All right. So we got Bombardier. Bonk. And we got Colonel Core. Boom. Two damage right there. <clears throat> and okay. So let's go ahead and work this guy. Drawing a card. Mm. Okay, so artillery. Well, let me put these, refresh our sanity. Artillery does a little damage. Ba boom! But he freaked our freak out and he hits me for one. We'll put that on our, our poor dudes there. Boop. Okay, moving on. Okay, they took a little damage and they struck back. However, that was indeed scary. We lost a little sanity, and we'll put a damage marker on our artillery. I gotta reshuffle this thing. Be right back. All right, all shuffled. Continuing our attack on Shogoth. Let's get it. Hmm? Okay. Ah, damn it. I don't have any armored car. Shoot, does it damage? Well, we're gonna just put it on our infantry but the infantry goes back to the barracks thanks to franz newman okay we can always so we're gonna keep pushing our luck here to keep keep at him oh boy this is a scary dude and we take another damage all right so yeah we're gonna do it but if we if we take any more damage i think we're just gonna back out we're gonna use corporal jones and undo nope air balloon oh wait I could do another damage, but I have to take that damage. And I would kill one of my guys. Franz wouldn't be able to save him. I'm going to use Corporal Jones and back out. So, undoing the effect of the last old one card and withdrawing from combat. Uh, then he goes well as I was hoping, but whatevs. We did a little damage, and now he's ticked off. And here they come. So here goes that. Let's do some movement. We got ourselves Shogoth, Migu, and a zombie. Nope. And the mosquito comes at two and then counterclockwise. So whoop. Now it's stopped it up. Okay, so, but they keep coming. Next card. Little old one. Mm -hmm. This one right here, it was a level two or Oh, goodness gracious. Oh, boy. I may have bit off more than I can chew here. Well, let's keep... Okay, two movement cards. Zombies. Six, and then clockwise. Whoop, so it's going to go there. And then... Oop, mosquito and Shogoth. So mosquito's just making a beeline. Or a mosquito line. And then we've got Shogoth four. 
Uh, I'm just going to head straight down. Straight down. Oh, gosh. Here they come. All right. Slightly terrifying. So, what are we going to do here? <laughs> oh, they're coming. Okay, we could get this guy and just do a quick two damage on somebody. That that might come in handy. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, quick two damage on any face-up old one. Huh. And I can't, I can't do any mining because they got me blocked up right now. Man, where's that mosquito? Would just hurry up. So let's go ahead and farm attack on a card day, remove old one temple. Let's go ahead and do this because I want some more money. And we're going to trade in you and you. Gotta get some more money. I think we're going to need some money to be able to do some attacks in a row. And then next thing we're going to do is, yeah, we're going to need some infantry, some cannon fodder. We're going to spend the one. Wait, you know what? Actually, let's instead, let's, let's get an armored car because I got the three money to do it. And now I'll kind of flesh out the whole unit. There we go. Besides, I've got Franz here to be able to help us out. Okay, here they come. Oh, man. There's a whole mass of old ones out there. So we have no loyalists, but we have Shogoth. It's going to move four. That's down. So down. And, oh, my gosh. If I can get my fingernails under there. Down. That was one card, two card. Okay, no Cthulhu, thank goodness. And we flip. And now they get to go again. Woo! They are revealing. Jeez. Okay, reveal all the one loves X. Okay, where are we at? That's just going to be this little one. Please be a kangaroo. Damn it. It's a little mosquito. That's all right. We got to do six cards for its movement. So one, two, three. Jeez Louise. Four. These things usually move a lot faster. Five. Okay, and it's going to move in the direction of six and then counterclockwise. So it's going to go here. How many was that? Five, six. Okay, there it comes. Straight up and then counterclockwise. So it's back to there again. All these guys are flying. You know, I should be able to just fly, you know, truck under these guys. They're flying, right? Shouldn't be blocking my track. <sighs> All right, but they get to keep moving. So that was the... The six for that card. Now it's two for general movement. Zombies keep coming. That is going to be... So one, two, three, one, two, three. I think that's going to go straight down. And then one more. <sighs> Bunch of lazy old ones. Get your asses over here. To my port. Stop getting in my way. All right. Well, now... Um, now we've had it. <laughs> oh, armored unit. So now my armored cart, let's do that. Let's get that guy. We're going to be able to take some more damage. It'll be one time. We're, we're geared up over here. We've got some serious personality. And that's going to be one. Yeah, there's one. Paid it. Okay. One victor point for every old one you've eliminated. Ooh, Matt Johnson. That might be good. Okay, let's go ahead and I think we're gonna we just gotta we gotta we gotta hit somebody. Who do we want to hit? This guy's in the way. We can reach that guy for two. Just all we can really do is a mosquito or the hmm. Or we can just let him bring it. Well, okay, this has got a range of, what do we got ranges of? So one, so everybody except for those two could come. We've got this guy. Mm, yeah, let's just go ahead and thin out the crowd a little bit. He's on my track, so I can use my armored train uh, and my airship. And then I can put two guys out here and, um, and be pretty effective and it's just gonna die pretty quick so i'll just put i'll put my infantry out here 
I remember if Armored Car or Artillery was best. Let's use this cheat sheet here for Migu. Infantry is good. Armored Car is good. Let's do Armored Car. Okay, Armored Car. All right, that's going to cost me one time. And, ah, oh, shit. Can't do it. <sighs> All that for that. Dang it. Can't do it because I don't have any. I just got to gotta go here and grab everybody back. For now. All right, here they come. Movement time. Okay, they're all coming. So this, so mosquitoes first. Boom, boom. And then Shogoth is going five and then counterclockwise. So boop and boop. Okay, that was just one card. Next one. Here they are more. Direction of two and then... Uh, counterclockwise so this way and this way okay jeez oh, louise <laughs> they get a draw card reveal the old one of those hex draw six cards okay but oh oh we get some gold yes we need gold i love it okay reveal the old one okay uh, yeah this might be short lived here i think it's you Ah, shoot. Okay, it's not going to move, though. Don't have to draw six cards for that guy. So, two movement cards. Here we go. Oh, and the mosquito makes it. Makes an appearance. One. And a two. And. Uh, and then a zombie. Go straight in. Now, I'm not sure if I have to draw, if I, if I do another card to complete the movement. Or not. I Let's just make it tougher and assume that I'm supposed to. I think I'm just supposed to complete the movement on that card and then do my thing. But let's just do the other one. See what happens. So, Mosquito moves. And then this guy shows up. Okay, alright. So let's say I have to fight both these guys. At the same time. So, essentially do all the damage, but I also get twice the damage. So here comes everybody. We got Bomba Bombardier Milligan. Got a guy there. We do some damage there. Armored cars or you know, oh, if your port is attacked, inflict two damage to start on on each attacker. Holy smokes. So we do okay, inflict one damage on one old one during combat. So I can only do one damage with that guy. If you have artillery present in combat, inflict one damage automatically. So we could just just essentially take out. Um, so you got two damage on you. You have two damage on you because anybody anyone says if your port is attacked, it's like two damage to start on each attacker. Now, where do I want to put the other attack? Um, we could just do one and one, right? We'll have a bombardier um, take a pot shot and knock out the mosquito. Um, and let's say, too, that they get to draw a card. I'm not even sure if that's the case, if they get to draw a card against me first. Uh, and then inflict one damage on old one during combat. And then we'll put this damage on you. Okay, so, now, to make it super duper fair, we're just going to go ahead and let them draw a card on me. And the mosquito, before he dies, takes a shot at my balloon. Jerk. And then, um... Shogoth here, ooh, does two damage. Uh, golly. I'll put it on him because he can take it. Artillery does the damage there. Okay, so, Mosquito, dead. Take you. And uh, we're at four damage. We're just going to keep on going. We've still got Franz Newman here. Our armored car can take some hits. And we can always undo if we have to. So here we go. That is, you know, so my airship out from the sky drops a bomb on Shogoth's face, but we take a damage. Put that on artillery. Okay, one more. One more is all we need. Get him! Oh, oh. First, he scares the crap out of me. Everybody poops their pants, and, but with one last ditch effort, boom. Dead, no damage. Artillery takes it out. Okay. Gotcha.
Everybody is alive and well. Very good. Okay. Now then. That was good. That was good. And now it's back to our turn. We're going to do that. I'm going to spend the one. One time. I'm not even going to mess around with that temple. We're going to have Desta Danger go in there. And, uh, oh man, remove one old one temple along with any old ones on it. Could wait, couldn't I? But what if they spawn and then move? That's what's going to happen. I know it. So I'm just going to use her right away. I'm just going to get rid of this, this temple. I don't want to take the chance. Okay, that was my one time, and I did that. What else do we want to do? Can't do really any mining. And let's just go ahead and uh, what do I want to do? Damn it. I just want to attack. Just take out that, that mosquito. Just seems like such a waste. No, let's build some track. Let's build some track so that we can get some farm action going. That's going to cost me two time, though. Is that a good idea? Yeah, because then we can do a little last-ditch effort farming, perhaps. And we'll just go here and here. No, I can't. I can't build out of that, so we'll just go there and there. Um, that seems like a waste, doesn't it? Whatever. I did it. Here we go. They're moving. Here we go. Let's see what happens. We've got a mosquito hot on our trail. Nothing else moves, unfortunately. Mosquito's here. Mosquito shows up. Mosquito dies. We don't even need to uh, entertain any kind of time on that. Okay. Um, and then, wait a second. Oh, yeah. So then, uh, now... Old ones. Here we go. Let's see what happens. Reveal the old one, the lowest hex. Okay. Comes. It's another temple. Mother. Okay. Two time. Or two movements is what I meant to say. Okay. Shogoth's coming. Three. Here it goes. And then. No mosquitoes. We got a zombie. Zombie moves on our port. Nothing else. Zombie dies. You're dead, zombie. And Shogoth still over there. Okay, we do another movement for Shogoth. Nope. And yep. Two and then clockwise. So it's going to go this way. Okay, he's coming. Let's go ahead. We need to start. We need to do some poking. We got to poke out. We're going to poke out in the outback. Let's do it. I'm going to spend attack action. Uh, we can't bring our armored train, but we can do the airship. And let's see here. Who does? So we extra damage. We're just going to do a quick skirmish there. So that way I don't have to spend one time on that because of Professor Guyon. And they can all... No, he doesn't have a range. Shoot. I want to find out what's in that. I can't, I can't bring you. But I can bring you. Because I got a range of two. Oh, shit. I can't bring that either. Urgh! But I want to know what's over there. So it's still going to cost me one time. But I just want to know what's over here. Let's flip it. Just a zombie. Okay. Nothing too bad. And then um, let's see here. So I am actually, I did take a, 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 an attack action. It's been a gold. And, right? Did I, did, I, did I just penalize myself? I'm not sure if I did. Artillery present. So nope. And then inflict one damage. So we get a damage on the zombie. And then that's about all the action there. But let's see if uh, the armored car and the uh, airship can do some damage. We don't have any <clears throat> infantry. Nope. 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 Boy, boy, this zombie is a dodgy son of a gun. Inventory. <clears throat> nope. Armored car. Yes. This could be a long, drawn-out infantry. Nope. And infantry. Nope. But, oh, <clears throat> time is taking its toll. We're getting a little freaked out. 
go. Oh, the armored car does another damage. Last card. Before I had to shuffle, nothing. Let me shuffle. All right, still in battle with the zombie locked in battle. And no armored train, no infantry. Do have an armored car, though. Take that. No infantry. Artillery, armored car. One more damage for a zombie, and zombie is dead skis. Boom, dead. Wow. Terrorizes me and does one more damage, which my armored cars can take three damage, so that's fine. Dead zombie. Again. Dead again. Okay. All right. That worked out pretty well. Um, let's just, okay, mm -hmm. shoot. Uh, okay, we're going to have to, we got to get our guys back because I don't have any enough gold to be able to do another attack. We're going to do that. I'm just going to go here. Bring them all back. I need to find out what's in, what's behind that door. Look for that. I'm going to go here. Old ones get to go again. Reveal old one, lowest hex, draw six cards. I think that is you, right? Yep. Number two. Okay. Six cards for the zombie. One, two, three, four zombie moves. It's just going to make a straight shot at me. Five. It's coming. Okay. There's the six. And now we have to draw two for everybody else. That would be Shogoth and a zombie. Nope. And nope. Okay, but they get another two cards to move. Here comes Shogoth. Uh, four. It's going to move down. Another one. Yep, here it comes. Almost there. Pretty much going to die as soon as it hit my port. So that's awesome. Just, just bring it. Okay. My turn. Now maybe I want to throw out some... No, I don't know. I was thinking... Ooh, ooh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, I can't mine there, but I could get those. That doesn't do me any good. I could just take out that zombie. I kind of have to because the zombie's in my way to be able to reach that three. So we're going to spend the time and the cube. And now with the zombie, though, we can bring that, that, that. And uh, artillery works particularly well. And that way we just have to spend one time. Thanks, Professor Blah, blah, blah. Um, ooh, but you know what? I, can't, I, can't, I just need that. I just want that extra. No, no, we'll just, we're not going to take that extra. And we are going to do uh, Colonel Quarry one. And then, oh, do we just get the one? I feel like we got more shots off than that. No? Okay, fine. Just the one damage then. Okay. Um, I think we got this guy, though, pretty quick. Here we go. Yep, inventory does the damage. Zombie. Air balloon. Dropped another. Uh, nothing. Uh, ah! He strikes back. Freaks are freak out. Uh, dead. Yes. Okay. Quick and easy. I like it. All right. Now. Back to my turn. Wasn't there a guy here? One for every... I think I'm going to get that guy. I think I'm going to get that guy. It's going to be one time because this guy's going to be worth some points. We're taking Mad Johnson here. Okay. But that means the old ones get to go. Here they come. Last card for the old ones. Oh, no. No. I knew it. Last ditch effort. Don't don't you dare. Okay. That's that could have been worse. Draw and place a level three oh one on each revealed temple. There's just the one. Oops, let's put that there. This here. <clears throat> I did not put my cube there. Dang it. Alright. Now they get to move. Which is fine. Yes. 
Shogoth comes a plop, and so does the Loyalist, moves at a five clockwise, so he goes there. And now let's do the other one. Um, nope. <clears throat> and then we'll go here again. And Shogoth is already at my port. The Loyalist never moves. He walks into a shitstorm of bombardeering goodness. One, two, uh, if ported attack, three, four, dead. Didn't even get a shot off. Okay, back to me. Now, let's see here. I think this is where, ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah, no, 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 no. Here we go. We're gonna go with one. I'm gonna spend the cube. I have the gold. To expose the old one. Wait, what am I taking? What am I taking? Um, okay, I only spend. I don't want to spend one. I can't bring my armored car or, or, or the train thing. I'm probably not going to kill it. Um, it's within two. So I, I just want to. I got to take. Not okay. I'll, I'll, I'll put the armored car away. So not only cost me one time, <clears throat> and let's see where it is. Are you kidding me? Well, by exposing him, I saved myself 12 points. But there's no way in hell I'm going to kill him. <sighs> you son of a bitch. All right. Well, just for showing your pretty face, I'm going to blast it in the face. For that, we're going to do one damage with Colonel Cor Cor Corai. One, two. And then um, we're going to get our ass kicked. Yeah. Okay, so <laughs> here we go. All right, let's see how we do. Uh, no armor train and okay, we there's that. And he takes a shot at our air balloon. Ouch. All right, I can take it. I'm losing my sanity. Wait, didn't I? Yeah, I moved to sanity. How did I? I think I had an extra sanity there. Um, ooh, artillery takes a shot at him though. Okay. No, no armor train. Hiya! Ooh, it's a quiet, peaceful day on the battlefield. Hiya! Ah! More sanity. <clears throat> okay, this might be it. I could lose my air balloon. It doesn't really matter, does it? Oh, oh, but I don't really because, um, yeah. So we'll go ahead. We'll we'll just <laughs> let's take another shot at him. Why not? Infantry. He takes out my air balloon. However, Franz Newman comes to the rescue. And let's keep going. Oh, air balloon. Oh, and we lost our sanity. We don't lose anybody, though. Nobody was injured. And that is the end of that battle. Well, okay. So my turn. Uh, I am just going to go here. And I'm going to gather up some points. Yeah, because I can get six points. Well, that's a different swing, though, isn't it? Oh, no, I have to, I can't, I can't, I can't do an attack action because I don't have the gold to be able to do it. So it would have been better if I could have killed that loyalist, but I can't. Let's just go here. We're going to spend one, two, three, and let's put out a bunch of farms just to get ourselves a couple more points. There's a, there's some corn and there's a sheep and a cow. Now we got all the gold. One, two, three. But we also got a few extra points, as long as they don't somehow make a crazy run for it. <clears throat> and two movement cards. Nope. And nope. All right. Shall we score? How'd we do? Each productive farm, two victory points. So I managed to do some quick farming there at the end. And I am at six. Each phosphate, three victory points. I got two of those, so I am at 12. No victory points in hand. Old ones that I killed. Yes, yes. Let's see how we did. Eight for you. Nine, 10, 11, 12, 13. Nothing. 14, 20, 22, 25, 27, 31, so 31, 12, so 13 plus 30. So we're at 43. Let's not forget Mad Johnson over here. 
Bonuses from personality cards. Plus one for every old one you have eliminated. That was how many again? So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So ten more points. Was it enough? We're at 53. Because here come the old ones. Each blighted farm? No. Face value. We've revealed ones on the board. We've got four, eight, and jerk face. Golly. Ooh, crap. So that is uh, 20 right there. 20 points. And now, oh my gosh, there's hardly anything out there. Three, four, doubled is eight. 28 points. That was an ass whooping. That was a, a, a Lovecraftian ass whooping right there. Well, I guess I'll see if I played that right. You can let me know if I played that right. I'll try and go through and see if I can see if I did anything wrong. But on insane level, I got 53. The old ones got 28. You know, there's something about the game that... that that bothers me is that you just shouldn't really be able I, I feel like you shouldn't be able to do that i went on insane level too often and and it just you shouldn't like on an insane level be able to win any game but the game i mean it's just it's just so much fun it's just it's just a grand old game and uh that was australia thank you for watching and again leave any comments or whatnot down below let me know uh, if i screwed up or um anything along those lines or any questions or concerns on board game rants thank you for watching